chapter 10 it is uh, exception handling in java right so let's start a quick chapter summary the first one exception so we believe that the compile program is error free and will always execute successfully right but in few cases the program can terminate while it is executing right so these are the some examples the program that can uh, connects to the particular website and download web pages but the suppose that there is no internet connection right? dealing with the different files and try to modify a read only file then uh, users try to open a file and thus uh, it is does not exist in the system so type of exceptions are in the java all kinds of error conditions are called exceptions right error can be broadly classified into these two categories the first one it is compile time errors then second one it is run time errors right? the exception result in an abnormal exception right and it, it may be lead to the abnormal termination of the program right it usually signals an error error so uh, compile or the compile time errors right so what is in that compile time errors the compiler it is used to convert the source codes into the object code right so, and these are the some examples of errors right syntax errors right missing commas right or the semicolons and use uh, undeclared variables wrong spellings uh, of identifier or the keywords and mismatch of brackets right so these are the different uh, examples of uh, compile time errors okay what is in that runtime errors if there is no syntax errors in the source code then the program will compile successfully and will get a class file dot class file right and uh, however this does not guarantee that the program will execute as per the expectations right so this is the one example in the program we have created an array of the city list right it is one dimension array, and the, that contains name of the four different cities right and we are trying to display the content of that elements of the city list array that it does not exist right so this way it will generate a runtime errors right so program executed successfully in computer science exit code or the existators indicates whether the program or uh, command or the programs executed successfully or not right exit code 0 means the command executed successfully and exit code 1 means the some pro problem occurs while executing the program so exception handling so what is in that exception handling uh, exception it is an error conditions in the java uses the three keywords to write an exception handler first one it is try that it contains the code of code to one or more exceptions and catch it is contains the code to handle the exceptions of a particular type and finally always executed before the program ends so what is in the try block the first it is a try statement contains a block of statements within a brackets curly brackets and a try block may give a rise to one or more exceptions right and syntax of the try block is you write try in the curly bracket write the set of statements right and curly bracket complete then next one it is after the try statement there is uh, there uh, has to has to be either a catch block or a finally block after that next one it is the catch block catch blocks must immediately follow try blocks and it contains the code that is to be executed to handle an exception catch block it is uh, an exception handler right so it will handle exception and last one it is the finally block the final block is generally used to clean up at the end of executing a try block and the finally block it is widely used if a file needed to be closed or 
uh, critical resources it is to be released at the compilations of the program after that throw statement it is uh, the throw keyword it is used to explicitly uh, throw an exception object so java virtual machine creates an exception object and was throwing it automatically and an example is given that an example of arithmetic exception was created when we try to perform the divide by zero operation so this is the end of chapter number 10 